Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Welcome. Welcome to our Sunday morning service. Amen. Welcome to our Sunday worship service, our Sunday morning worship service. Amen. Hallelujah. We give God the glory, give God the praise for being back in the house of God one more time. Hallelujah. Thank you for tuning in on with Light of the World on this morning. We thank you. Hallelujah. We give God the praise. We're going to give him all the glory, all that we have. Hallelujah. We thank you. Hallelujah. We thank you, Jesus. Glory. We glorify your name on today. Hallelujah. We're going to lift up the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. So wherever you are, join in, tune in with us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We're going to give him all that we have. Hallelujah. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. We thank you. Thank you, we thank you. Hallelujah. He's worthy. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. You deserve the glory. And the in the precious name of Jesus. God, we thank you, God, for another day you have blessed us. God, another day, God, it is we are closed in our right mind. Another day, Father, for the activities of our limbs. Father, we just want to say thank you this morning, God, for all that you've done and, God, that all that you're going to do. God, we ask, God, as we enter into your presence this morning, God, humbly, God, we ask, God, that you move by your spirit. God, that you move by your power. God, that every yoke, God, be broken, God, in the precious name of Jesus. God, you have your way, God, like only you can. In Jesus' name, God, you move, God, like only you can. God, bless our youth this morning. Let your spirit and anointing, God, God, overflow onto them this morning, God. For God, we praise you. We magnify your name. God, look on the speaker of the hour this morning. God, let your anointing flow, God, through your word. God, that they may pierce our hearts, God, and heal. 
God, the brokenhearted, in the precious name of Jesus. Uplift, God, the burdenhearted. God, let yokes, God, be broken, God, this morning through your word. And God, we thank you. Those that are watching, God, we ask God that you touch their homes, touch their lives. God, let your anointing even flow, God, to the TV screen. And God, let your power, God, and your anointing have your way, God, even in their lives. And God, we give your name the praise. God, we give your name the glory. Those that are making their way, God, to your house this morning. We ask God that you move, God, even in their life. In the precious name of Jesus. And we'll give your name the praise, God. And we'll give your name the glory and the honor. In the precious name of Jesus. Come on, bless the Lord. Come on, bless God. Come on, he's worthy. Hallelujah, he's worthy. Hallelujah, you ought to give him a praise this morning. You ought to bless him in this house this morning. You ought to tell him thank you, Jesus, this morning. Hallelujah. Somebody ought to tell God he's worthy. Somebody ought to tell him he's worthy. Come on, somebody ought to tell him he's worthy. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Come on, clap those hands and bless God. Come on, bless him in this house. Bless him in this house. Wherever you are, you are a blessing. Come on, bless him. Hallelujah, Jesus.
every service. Hallelujah. You have a testimony to say. To give one more song to say. Hallelujah. May bless the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm running for my life. I'm running for my life.
Come on, come on. You ought to bless the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. God's got it. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. God got it. Whatever we need, God's got it. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. At this moment in time, we're going to honor the leaders of the church. Amen. Hallelujah. We're going to give honor to where honor is due. Amen. To our overseer, Apostle Johnny L. Jones. Hallelujah. Amen. To his lovely wife, Evangelist Jones, women's supervisor of the Women's Minister Board. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Give your honor to our pastor on today. Hallelujah. Elder Timothy Brown. And to our assistant, Brown Pastor, Taranja, Evangelist Taranja Sampson. Amen. To the mothers in the church today, to the lay members, to, to Deacon, um, to, I'm sorry, to, to Deacon Smith and his absent, to Prophetess Smith and her absence. Amen. To all the deacons in their respectful places, to Deacon Kent, even to um, um, Sister December in the back, down to the little children. Amen. Hallelujah. Giving honor to what honor is due on today. Amen. Hallelujah. We thank you for each and every one that has joined in the service so far. Amen. Hallelujah. We thank you, Jesus. At this moment in time, before we lift up the before we lift the off, we're gonna have a poem that's gonna come by one of our youth on this morning. They're gonna honor us with a poem on today. Amen. I ask that Brother Glenn would come on up to give us his poem today. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. These weapons, they said they wanted to do something on today. We had to ask them. But they say, yeah, they're willing to do it. So we're going to give them a chance to, to do it. Amen. Hallelujah. When their heart desires, we're going to let them do it. Amen. Not going to shun them away, but we're going to let them do it in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Thanksgiving Day rolls around. Does they got something? It was called More Than a Little. As Thanksgiving Day rolls around, it brings up some facts quite profound. We may think that we are poor, feel like bumpers if we could, but in truth, our riches are strong. We have friends and family we love. We are guardian and heaven above. We have so much more than just sales in the store. We are wealthy and push something good. For us, your blessings are said on Thanksgiving last more than a day. Enjoy who you got. It lets us a lot, and, and you'll make all your plans go well. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. More than a day is what his poem is called. Hallelujah. Everything is more than a day. Even though it's getting ready to be around that time for us to be for Thanksgiving, when people pull out the turkeys and all the extra trimmings and dressing, but every day is Thanksgiving. We be thankful that God allowed us to see this day, even allowed us to see Thanksgiving. Amen. Hallelujah. For more than a day, we're still thankful and grateful that God is still sits high and looks low. Amen. To keep us what we're doing every single day. Hallelujah. At this moment, President Time, we're going to get ready to lift up our offering unto the Lord. Amen. <clears throat> and we're going to tell you our ways of giving. Amen. One second. Hallelujah. I'm going to tell you several ways of how you can give on Tonight's Round today. If you're not in the sanctuary today or wherever you may be, that you can still give on to Light of the World on today. Amen. You can give cash at dollar sign L-I-G-H-T 4701. That's cash at dollar sign L-I-G-H-T 4701. You can give it by PayPal, www. Tithing. 
You just T I T H E dot L Y. Also, you can give it by mail, which is Light of the World Church, which is going to be 4701 North 15th Street, Florida, 33610. That's Light of the World Church, 4701 North 15th Street, Tampa, Florida, 33610. And if you desire to give it by post box, you can do it also by mail, Light of the World Church, post box, Tampa, Florida, 33675. Amen. That's three three six seven five. If you have ways to give, Amen. Hallelujah. At this point in time, we're gonna have Deacon um, Kende and we're gonna have Brother Glenn gonna help us raise the offering on tomorrow morning. Amen. Hallelujah. Lift the hands and say, No weapon form against me shall, shall prosper. No, 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 it won't work. No weapon form against me shall prosper. No, no, it won't work.
somebody ought to say, no, I'm not yet. Give God a praise. Come on, bless his name. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, tell him, thank you, Jesus. Heads bow, all eyes closed. Dear Heavenly Father, we come for you once again, give you thanks and praise. Continue to keep us folded underneath your cover and under your blood as you go through this, go through this standard of keeping us on the solid grounds, keeping us at out of quarantine, keeping us steadfast. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Whew. Amen. Praise God. Let's give your hand a round of applause for your blessing on this morning. Amen. That's how we get blessed. Giving. Giving unto the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We'll keep it moving. We're going to have our other youth. They're going to come up and she's going to give us a poem before we bring the speaker of the hour up front. Amen. Amen. We're going to call Sister Kylie Green. She's going to come up and give us a, a poem also. Amen. Thank you. So my poem is called, Let's Be Thankful. Let's be thankful for this day, for our friends and for our play. Let's be thankful, let's be glad for our food and for these and the things we have. Let's give thanks for you and me 
in our home and family. Hallelujah. today. Amen. Being willing vessels for the Lord. No matter what, you know, even when I'm being pressed, Tim, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do? You know, still go ahead on. Okay, okay. You know, but I praise God for them for, for doing it, being obedient and going out their way just to, you know, find something to say, I'll do this and I'll do that. I yet and say thank you. I thank you for them for all that they do. I'm grateful for the you. I'm missing some, but yet and still, are we gonna keep moving on with the we do have. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. At this present moment in time, what I said, everyone stand to their feet. We're going to get ready to bring um, the speaker of the hour up on this morning. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, sir. Amen. At this moment in time, we're going to introduce our assistant pastor, Pastor Taronda Sampson. We give her a hearty welcome as she comes to your front. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Amen. Jesus. I surrender all to you. Everything I give to you. With With holding nothing, with holding nothing, with holding nothing, I surrender.
Heavenly Father, dear God, we thank you right now in the name of Jesus. Father God, I surrender all to you, Lord God. I humbly submit myself into your hands. Father God, I ask that you help me to decrease, that you may increase. And Father, have your way. Hallelujah. Lord God, speak through these lips of clay. Lord God, we just want to say thank you for what you're doing in this hour and in this place. Thank you for what you're doing in your people right now in the name of Jesus. Lord God, hallelujah, we honor you and we thank you. Hallelujah, we bow down in your presence, oh God. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Father God, I ask that you would just have your way. Have your way, Lord God. Lord God, just have your way. Do what you want to do. Do it any way you want to, Lord. I just want to let you know I'm a willing vessel, oh God. Oh God, you can use me. Hallelujah, Jesus. Lord, I thank you. I thank you for your people, Lord. I thank you for the people that's in your house. Those that are viewing, Lord God. Whether it's by Facebook, oh God. Hallelujah, by YouTube. Lord God, we come and we give you praise. is holy. 
holy ground. Hallelujah, Jesus. And I just want to start right there. Glory to God. Now Moses was tending the flock of Jethro, his father-in-law, the priest of Midian. And he was led, and he led the flock to the bank of the death. Glory to God, hallelujah. And praise God. It said that he came the whole way, the mountain of God. Now, Moab was merely a workplace for Moses. Glory to God. And hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. It was a place where he worked. For Moses, it was like going to the office. He had worked there for 40 years. He was tending to the sheep of his father-in-law. Nothing unusual had ever happened there before. But Mount Horeb is better known to us as Mount Sinai. But at this time, the Mount did not carry with it condemnation of thunder and lightning, smoke billowing up into the heavens, and the awesome presence of Almighty God. To him, it was just a mountain at that time. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, God. The thunder roaring hadn't took place yet. The smoke coming out of it hadn't took place yet. So it looked like it was nothing magnificent about this mountain. My God. Hallelujah. He was just doing what he was supposed to do. He was just feeding, oh, God, tending the sheep. Moses was going there for the food for the sheep. And he was just out there doing what he did every day. He was out there caring for the sheep. Ha. But let me tell you, the reality was that God had always been on that mountain. God had watched him just as he had See, he was always been present. See, God is always present. No matter what you're doing, God is always there. God waited 40 years for Moses to come to a place in his life where he could be entrusted with the divine assignment. You know the story? God had already told Moses that he was supposed to deliver Israel. He had fleed, praise God. He had seen the miracles. He had crossed the Red Sea. Not yet, hallelujah, but was going to cross the Red Sea. But at this time, he had not seen any of this stuff. All he was was just, um, oh God, just a man tending sheep. All he was was just somebody working for his father-in-law because he had married his daughter. My God, hallelujah. He didn't know, praise God, all the miraculous things that would happen. He didn't know at that time. Glory to God, how God would move for him to be a deliverer. He had been told that he was supposed to deliver God's people. But nothing had took place at that time. It had not yet come to pass. Hallelujah. But, hallelujah, one thing happened. One day, back down on the back side of the desert, looking at this mountain, hallelujah, something began to happen. See, sometimes God help us in a place. Glory to God. Where he is preparing us for greater things. Sometimes he has us in a place where it looks like the promise of God is not going to come to pass. Sometimes he has us in a place where it looks like nothing is happening. Glory to 
of his father-in-law. So God, praise God, hallelujah, Jesus, he had looked at him, praise God, and saw his faithfulness. He had proven himself faithful in leading the sheep. Glory to God. God went and trust an entire nation to him, to his care. See, glory to God, the word of God tells us, be faithful over the little things, and he can reward you with bigger things. Glory to God. If you're not faithful in the small things, how can God reward you with something big? If you're not faithful in the little things that he tell you to do, just the very simple things. Glory to God. How can he award you with big things? With